Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Come here, GTO. We'll get him later. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to TRX Car Reviews. Yes, C Series 31 is here. If we come to the festival playlist just over here, <sighs> it's European Automotive. And we've unlocked the Aston Martin Valkyrie AMR and a Renault. It's a Megan RS. Okay. Press X and we've claimed them. Let's um, see new cars. Great. Let's go to my horizon and travel to my house. Loading. There we go. Two new cars. Aston Martin, Valkyrie, AMR Pro, and the Megan RS. Let's customize our AMR because this car is a highly anticipated beast. I've just looked at um, those stats. Now, Forza have actually made the AMR Pro worse for some reason. So usually in real life, this is a one of 40 car and it's got a thousand horsepower. Forza says it's got 800. The reason why they did this, they actually did it in the notes. They said that they made it worse because then it'd be X-Class bone stock. So X-Class just like my Valkyrie up here. So let's get into the car. I like that introduction. So, we're in the Forza Vista now. Wow, look at this. From the back, one of the key changes um, comparing against the normal Aston Martin Valkyrie is this absolutely monstrosity of a wing. Now, that's really large. It sticks out from the back. Wow. That's going to be a lot of downforce. Let's open the door. Oh, that's cool. If you get inside here. Look at that steering wheel. This car is basically a Formula One car. Not even for the road. It's just way too extreme. So let's go back. Go into upgrades and tuning. See what we've got. Oh, yes. So, we've got some drivetrain. So, we can make this all-wheel drive. Yes. Ties and rims. Let's make the wheels a little thicker. Three two fives on the front. Wow. Okay. As semi-slicks actually take away the grip, so that means we are on racing slicks. Standard. This thing's got restrictor plates, and these are the things which Forza have um, done to make this thing got 800 horsepower. Now, if I take the restrictor plate off, it's only 650 credits. Now, we have the full 1,000 horsepower of the one in real life. We can make an off-road... Oh, my. That does not look right. Oh, look at the suspension. There's also drift suspension. That's good to know. We're not going to change the transmission. Let's modify the car. 15,000 credits. Let's do this. Always takes a while to save. So, for the design, so let's go to paint car. It's going to prepare the design editor. We have Aston Martin Green. Aston Martin Green. And Aston Martin Almost Green. Um, let's select this, that's really cool. Um, save to current car, and let's take this out for a drive. A few hours later. Takes a long time. There we go. Let's press menu button, we are driving now. Yeah, 
Okay, let's take this out for a little drive. I'm not going to turn right because then. Why is not miserable, Haley? Sunny. First of all, this thing's an absolute weapon. Look at the acceleration. <laughs> and this thing goes all the way up to 12,000 RPM. Wait, let's just do a quick sound check. Okay, well played. That is really good. So, that's it. The Aston Martin AMR Pro. Yes, you did see a Renault Megane, but that's just a recycled car, which basically means it's an older car from older Forza games, which is returned into Horizon 5. So we're not going to cover that because, got to be honest, the Renault's a bit boring. Um, thank you very much for watching the video. Make sure you like and subscribe. At the time of filming... We are 10 subscribers away from 500, so I would really appreciate if you help us. I'll see you in the next video. Bye!